All right, we have more news out there. What, yeah. what else is out there? Rocha? Guardians of the Galaxy. A lot yeah. of rumors here going on uh, for Volume 3. Everyone's everyone's so excited that James Gunn is coming back. For the most part, everyone's excited. Yeah. Uh, now they have announced uh, that they are going to start shooting, being in production, rather, in February of 2021, which means we won't see this thing for another three or four years oh, at least. Wow. 20, so. I mean, at least if, like, I, and I saw that a lot of outlets cover, I think it was Production Weekly that dropped it yeah. that was like, so Marvel hasn't confirmed, but let's put it this way. It makes a lot of sense because mm. James Gunn is going to shoot the Suicide Squad. So that's going to be in the next year. Mm. So that's 20, and then it's dated. When is the Suicide Squad dated? They dated it for... Is it called The Suicide Squad? Yeah. Now? yeah. So that's the only thing they changed is The. They well, added The. So then it's they, to help the older crowd. Then you hear yeah. <laughs> that they, you know, they were trying to get Will Smith back as Deadshot, and then... I, Idris Elba comes yeah. in because so now, of whatever scheduling or what, what they said, but I think there was something else. And they basically confirmed that it's a, a reboot, right? Yes, a soft reboot. Yeah. Is what they said. Yeah. So, but then, but then we hear Margot Robbie is coming back, so there is some continuity there. But then the producer comes out and says, "No, no, no, this is a total reboot." And I'm like, mm-hmm. "What? Well, okay, whatever." But um, as long as it's good, I don't care. As long as it's good. Right. Yeah. And I love that James Gunn is doing it because I, I, I think him. On the Suicide Squad gets me a lot more excited, mm-hmm. um, especially yeah. because he has a, a sort of a horror background. He so, has the horror background, so and, maybe it'll be darker and cool. Yeah, and DC's in their groove right now. Yeah. They really yeah. seem yeah. to have like looked to their filmmakers and gone, "There you go, do it." Yeah, and so James Gunn is going to do that. So that's when is Suicide Squad? Dated? August sixth, twenty twenty one. This was as of two or three days ago. Warner Brothers confirmed that okay. that's when it will be released. So if we think about it that way, he's going to be working on the Suicide Squad. He already wrote the script for Guardians 3, mm-hmm. and that was confirmed by Feige that they were going to use that before they brought him back on. So yeah. Gunn's mm-hmm. going to be working this year, 2019, shooting 2020, mm-hmm. editing, post, all that, 2020, 2021 release. Then he starts working on Guardians yeah. 3. Yeah. So that makes sense. Do it 2021, start shooting, editing everything, 2022. When did Volume mm-hmm. 2 come out? Uh, like two 2017? Years ago? Years ago. I think so. Two years ago. Yeah. Is it Isn't 2017? That, okay. Can you guys imagine having that much responsibility <laughs> well, right? on these no. like huge, <laughs> no. big, big budget movies? Mm-hmm. I would be terrified. Yeah. I think that's why my concern when we did our video is like, I don't know if he's going to be able to go from this to this oh. so seamlessly. It's two large ensemble uh, franchises. One you're kind of rebooting, another one you're coming back to. It's right. a lot. Yeah, it's a little bit. I pressure. think he can do it. But yeah. I mean, he's, I not, he he's also do not it. doing it alone, right? Like, there's a lot of, course. of people. Of course. Yeah, so, he has yeah. his peeps with him. I think I think it's great because wherever you land with James Gunn on the whole thing, I mean, we we talked about it endlessly on the show and everywhere. Everybody's been talking about it. The the fact of the matter is, two big studios have mm-hmm. forgiven. Would you call it that? Look, just been like, well, hey, yeah, this is it. We, we, I mean, because when Warner Brothers, I thought that was like a few shots across the bow of Marvel. Mm-hmm. They're like, oh, you don't want them? We want them. Right. And I found that fascinating to mm-hmm. me. And I wonder if that changed some of the conversations within Disney and then all the way through Marvel. And it's like, ultimately, he came back. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, I'm excited, and yeah. but I think to your point, Roka, I think he can do it. Okay, I think he can do it, and he because he already has the script, and he was doing some pre-production, mm. so he probably has a lot of things already planned, already kind of in motion for Volume Three when everything went down, so he can come back to that. But my point is, it's like five five years between Guardians movies. That's that's the thing. I know people think I'm crazy, but I just have a feeling that. There's going to be creative differences between him and DC for Suicide Squad. Oh, Marvel's going to want Guardians of the Galaxy quicker. It was supposed to come out this year after Spider-Man: Far From Home, oh. and so I think. Do you think they're going to want it quicker though? With with this whole you know Fox right, going with the into merger. I yeah. don't know. I don't know. 